Good afternoon, Gurpreet. Landon Scholes here with Lexus of Kelowna, sales manager at the dealership. Just wanted to go over a trade evaluation of your 2011 uh, Dodge Ram Sport with the crew cab. Uh, I've got some examples in front of me of what I feel are good market comparables. Uh, we can go through those together. Hopefully you feel the same way. I'm sure you will. Um, I've obviously taken into consideration that you are a detailer and the uh, vehicle is going to be incredibly clean when it comes to us. So you'll see that when I get to the eventual uh, trade evaluation sheet, but we'll go through these examples together and sort of guide you along as to how I think the vehicle should be priced in the marketplace and then eventually what we'd be able to pay for it. So we'll go through those together here. Here's the first example. It's one year newer than yours. It's a 2012 Ram 1500 big horn edition with navigation, heated seats. Um, it's got a fair bit lower kilometers than yours as well, being that it is one year newer and just hasn't been driven quite as much. 81,000 K on this 2012. Asking price on the vehicle is 27,995, which is understandable um, because of the lower kilometers and one year newer and actually higher package as well. Here's a 2012 Ram 1500 Sport Crew Cab, essentially the same vehicle as yours, but one year newer. Got really similar kilometers as well, 137,700K. 24.9 is the asking price on that truck. Another example here, 2011 Ram 1500 Laramie Edition is this one. So uh, a couple packages higher than what yours is. 135,000 kilometers on it. Asking price is 25.5. Here's Black Book. Uh, so Black Book we sort of use as a background guide. I don't necessarily use it for evaluating the cars. These examples here, the high and the low, are what on average uh, another dealership would be willing to pay for the vehicle as it would sit in lot ready condition. Uh, so as you can see, I've selected sunroof leather, navigation system, and 138,000 kilometers and it gives us the range anywhere between 16,833 and 19,308 as the, uh, the values that other dealers would be willing to pay for the vehicle. Here is our actual trade evaluation. So everything would be subject to viewing. Um, I would need to see the vehicle here in person to confirm everything, but very rarely do I change these numbers um, as people, generally speaking, and our sales consultants uh, get the full picture from you at that time. And that's why we ask as many questions as we do. 2011 Dodge Ram 1500 Sport with 138K. My asking price would be 23,995. I know that's a little under where you currently have yours listed at, but uh, in evaluating the market, um, 23,995 is uh, is where I feel an accurate price is. My dealership cost after reconditioning, um, this is what would be directly relatable back to those black book numbers. $20,356, which is 85% of this retail figure right here. I would have to do a detail. Normally my detail charge is $475, which would include a cut polish. I've uh, docked $100 off of that because of the fact that the vehicle is incredibly clean. $100 allowed for chip repair and just some minor cosmetic touches, uh, touch ups here and there. And then $400 allowed for an inspection and nothing else because you recently had the vehicle uh, made your service. At the end of the day, I'd be able to pay you $19,481 for the vehicle, which is the equivalent of selling it privately for $21,818. Um, obviously, when you sell it privately, uh, the next buyer would have to pay the taxes on it. When you trade it in, you save taxes on the vehicle. You're only paying on the difference. Uh, so that's the reason why uh, it ends up uh, being more with tax savings and that, that sort of selling privately equivalent. So I hope that you found this to be informative. If you have any questions, uh, f please feel free to ask Dwayne or myself. Um, we'll be both be at the dealership to six o'clock today. Uh, with interest in our 2013 GS, it's currently sitting in the showroom. Um, Dwayne will probably, you can even spin it around and show you that it's out there right now. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll walk you through that vehicle later on today and uh, make sure it's everything that you expect it to be. And uh, we'll take it all from there. Thanks so much for the opportunity, Gurpreet, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.